of spring training and pushed back opening day by uh, at least two weeks. The Buffalo Bills have suspended the travel of coaches and scouts and the New York State High School Winter Sports Championships have been suspended indefinitely and more to come. I'm Adam Benini, Channel 2 Sports. So you've probably heard the phrase flatten the curve. You've probably seen this animation, but what does it mean and why does it matter? Here are some facts. In this country, we have a finite number of health care resources. Only so many doctors, nurses, hospital beds, ventilators. A big concern among experts is that the system will get overwhelmed if we have too many serious coronavirus cases at once. So the speed of the outbreak matters a lot. Back to the chart, as time goes on, the number of cases increases until it hits a peak. On the left, what it looks like without protective measures. It's like a mountain. Compare that to the hill. That's what happens if we as a people do take protective measures. A lot of people still get the virus, but it's spread out over a longer period of time. That way we stay under the healthcare system's capacity. By taking protective measures, you flatten the curve and save lives. Just look at Italy. The healthcare system there has been so overwhelmed that physicians are rationing care, deciding who gets treated and who doesn't. So if you're wondering why parades are canceled, why sporting events are put on hold, and why people are being told to practice social distancing, it's because if we don't flatten the curve, people who need care may not get it. And today we also got